Yan. Nandito tayo sa Kogyo Market. May kailangan ko ng baboy. It's very... Sige, ito na lang. Now, let's go home and cook. Ito, you will love this recipe. I'm hungry! Let's cook! Come on! We're home. It's almost lunch time. Ito, kailangan natin ng ulam kasi nagugutom na kami. And ganun tayo sa market. And I have my pork spare ribs and I'm making a very delicious old-fashioned style na asado using tomatoes. Wala tayong tomato sauce. And let's start to aking pork ribs. Siguro mga almost 2 kilos to. Very important to marinate our meat ahead of time. We're using Maggi Sabor, calamansi flavor for this. Kasi dapat kasi calamansi and soy sauce to. Pero ito, mas malinamnam kasi. Yeah, I like this. And sometimes kasi sa bahay, wala tayong calamansi. So it's very convenient to use. So I do this ahead of time para may time na manot yung lasa. Set that aside. Mince our onions. And a lot of times, we want dishes that are easy to make. This one takes a bit of time kasi kailangan mong palumbutin yung meat, no? Pero as the meat cooks, all the flavors come together. So it's very simple to do. And all you need is a bit of patience. Heat up my wok. No? You can use a pressure cooker for this, pero I recommend not to. And just slow cook. Start with my onions. Gisa-gisa, no? We want it to be tender and translucent. This is a head of garlic, which I will just chop up. So when you're cooking at home, you don't have to be meticulous about your knife cuts. Just chop them up. You know, we want simple, we want delicious. Yeah. Garlic. Saute, saute. And I have here chicken livers. Ito, nakabili tayo kay ate ng atay. No? Chicken livers which will enrich the sauce. So instead of using the usual na canned liver spread, I like using yung chicken livers because it's more silkier. Just clean up. And what I will do here with the chicken livers, I will chop. So this one will thicken our sauce so it's easier to mash later on and it will disintegrate into the sauce. Add to our saute. Add the hearts. Be sure to wash properly. Ah. Gisa, gisa. Season with a bit of salt. This will be the base of our dish. Now add our pork. Gisa, gisa ng ating pork. I'm adding my achuete for color. Soy sauce here, just a bit of soy sauce. Let's cook that. So this is a very old-fashioned dish, of course, updated for convenience. Now I'm adding my tomatoes. You can dice it up, parang ganyan. Or what you can do, just smash it with your hands. And this will create a very nice sauce. Add everything there. And ang hahanapin nyo dito, yung pinaka hinog na kamatis. So, we're using about a kilo of tomatoes. Down ng laurel, a bit of sugar to balance. We don't want to make it sweet. Black pepper. And let's just mix everything together. And just a little bit of Maggi Magic Sarap to make it even better. And mix. Make life easier. Yan. Now, let's just cover all of this until it becomes so tender, so delicious, so rich. And let's check, ha? Let's check our asado. Look at that, no? We did not add any water or any liquid. Ito, the Liquid from our tomatoes and the pork. So, unti unti, we just smash the tomatoes little by little. So, we can serve this with fried potatoes on the side or as garnish. Pero ito, ganito lang ka simple. 
Very simple to do cover. And I will just prepare my bell peppers. Cut it into strips. This will be added just before maluto yung ating pork. And for dishes like this, mas sarap talaga pag may konting ang hang. Add some bird's eye chili. Pero uuna ko na siya. No? I'll just add it now so that it really blends well with the sauce. So if you're liking this recipe, don't forget to follow and subscribe to my channels, Chef Tato. I will add my bell peppers for more flavor. Add it there. And all we have to do now is wait until the pork is tender and the sauce is very rich. Don't forget to cook your rice. Cook extra rice. Because I'm sure with this kind of ulam, you will eat a lot. And it's been cooking for close to 30 minutes. And look at that. So beautiful. What we do at this point is pahinaan na natin yung ating temperature to a low simmer to thicken the sauce and make sure na ang ating pork tender but not too tender that it already crumbles. So we still want that meatiness but we want the fat to jiggle. We want that by counting jiggle yung fat. And I will taste the sauce. Shut up. Look at that. Beautiful, di ba? Yan ang sinasabi ko, no? Nagre-render na yung ating orange na oil. Look at that on the side, no? And it becomes even more delicious the day after. Ang problema, mauubos to ngayon. You can add here, di ba? Carrots, potatoes. Gisantes, no? green peas. Very simple, straightforward, easy to do. You can do this with chicken, with beef, and just like me today, I'm using pork. And here it is, our special recipe for today, old-fashioned pork asado. Simple! Tara, kain tayo! This is a dish that requires so much rice. That's just a cup. And we have our sauce, our delicious sauce. Look at the sauce. That's the sauce. Mmm! So, just the right ratio of lean to fat. So imagine this dish uses just real tomatoes. Not tomato sauce, but oh, it's so good. Mm. Simple and straightforward can still be very amazing when done right. Mm.